If anybody has any reason these two shouldn't be married, speak now or forever hold your peace. I do! Mom, you can't marry Frank! He is a robot! <gasps> Mark, stop it! You are embarrassing me! I'm trying to save you from making the worst decision of your life! You know what, Mark? Just get out! Mom! Just go! believe you would try to ruin our wedding what is wrong with you mom frank is a robot and he's evil he's only gonna hurt what? us mark that is not true i would never try to hurt you or your mother and i'm definitely not a robot shut up frank don't you dare talk to frank like that this ends now uh, i can't believe it you're not listening to me you know what i'm just gonna go to my room <sighs> oh my gosh honey i'm so sorry about that Wait, are you okay? You don't look so good. Oh, it's uh no, 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 nothing. I, I need to just go to, go to the gar garage real quick. Battery low. Charging cycle beginning. <gasps> I knew it. He is a robot. Ah! I knew he was a robot. I just can't believe no one believes me. I just want my mom to be safe. Mark, oh, there you are. Stop right there. <sighs> what is your problem? Problem? My problem is you married a robot, Mom. I'm worried about Frank you. Frank is not a robot, Mark. This has to stop. I'm sorry, Mom. I just can't stand by while you do this. What if he's evil? Okay, Mark. I, I think I know what the real problem is, and I understand, okay? What are you talking about? Look, I know it's been a while since your dad passed away, and I understand that you're having a hard time dealing with this and moving on. That is not the case, Mom. The case is that you married a robot. Honey, look, it's okay to be upset. But taking it out on Frank isn't okay. If that's even his name. Mom, I saw him with my own two eyes. He is a robot. But you need to at least respect that I'm married to Frank and that I love him. Please, can you do that for me? I just want you to be happy, Mom. I'll be nice. But I will have my eye on Frank. I know there's something wrong here, Mom. I just know it. Mark, I know you and I aren't super close. Yeah, obviously. But as your stepfather, I want you to know that I'll always be there for you, no matter what. Yeah, sure. Ugh, look, I don't know what you think you saw the other night, but I am not a robot. Yeah, you definitely are. And I want to know what your end game is, Frank. I just love your mother, that's it. And I'm going to try to be a good stepfather for you. Yeah, well, I love my mom too. That's why I'm so suspicious of you. And that's why I know you are a robot. Look, you need to worry about your own business, okay? I promise. I promise you, I am not a robot, Mark. Yeah? Then prove it. Jump into the ocean with me. What? You heard me. Jump in the water. These waters are super dangerous. It's high tide. There could be sharks. There are rocks under there. Yeah? Well, I'm jumping in. And if you don't, it's going to prove that you're a robot. Mark, you better stop right now. Uh, Mark, no! Defense mode activate. Uh, uh, help! I, I, can't, I can't swim! Uh, uh, you you did jump in. You saved me. Uh, of course. You're malfunctioning or something. No, no, I, I'm, I'm not malfunctioning. Uh, I knew it! I just don't understand it, Dylan. How could he survive that? I mean, he was a robot. Well, it is the 21st century, Mark. I mean, robots are probably waterproof at this point. I don't know. I'm just freaked out. I mean, my mom married this guy. I just have a bad feeling about this. Are you sure this is about him being a robot and not about, I don't know, your mom moving on? I just don't want some crazy killer robot running around, burning down my house, attacking our neighborhood. Dude, I build robots. Most of them are just like people and don't want anything like that. If you want, I could look into Frank and see what's up. Really? You would do that? Of course, man. Well, thanks. I'd really appreciate it. Try and find out as much as you can. I need to know more about Frank. All right, I don't think anybody's home. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. There's his computer. Oh, this should be so easy to hack into. Just give me a couple. Well, hurry up. I don't want us to get caught. Just chill out. Okay, wait, I think I got it. Awesome. Do you see anything? Anything out of the ordinary? Oh, uh, he does have a robot app on here. Yeah, he, he, he's definitely a robot. I knew it. Open the app. I want to see if he's evil or not. Yeah, no problem. Oh, this is... What is it? What on earth are you two doing? Frank! Uh, sir, we're not doing anything. Definitely did not hack into your computer. <laughs> you boys are lying. I can tell. Uh, I knew it. See, dude, he is a robot. You invaded my personal space. That is my laptop. How could you do this, Mark? Why don't you trust me? Are you kidding me? Because you're lying about who you are, Frank. I saw your robot app. I know the truth. 
The truth is, my name is Frank. What I'm made of doesn't matter. Yes, it does. I don't want my mom to get hurt, and I don't want her to have anything to do with you. This is ridiculous. Look, you and I haven't spent a whole lot of time together, and I think that needs to change. That way, you can see I'm a good guy, and I'm just Frank. <laughs> oh, Mark, that was an awesome movie. Great choice. Yeah, that was a pretty good movie. And I had no idea they were putting Flaming Hot Cheetos in popcorn now. Incredible. Yeah, it was pretty good. Thanks for getting that for me. Of course, not a problem. You know what, Frank? Maybe I was wrong about you. Sorry about being so awful. Really? Yeah, but I think you still need to tell my mom the truth. <sighs> not this again. Yes, this again. Frank, you are a robot, and you need to just admit it and tell the truth. I'm just going to call my mom, and you're going to talk to her. Mark, stop being like this. Stop being like what? Mark, watch out! What? Oh, Frank, are you okay? I, I'm, I'm, I'm fi fine. You just got hit by a car. How are you fine? You know what? Whatever, Mark. You can think whatever you want. But if you can't see that I'm a good guy after all of this, that's on you. And uh, I think you need to call 911. That driver probably hit his head pretty Frank? hard. Frank? Frank? I need to reboot my system. System after that hit. Man, I do not feel good. I need to go back to my charging station. Charging cycle begin. System rebooting. Ah, uh, that's better. Just a, uh, a little breath. Frank! Frank, where are you? <gasps> oh my gosh! Rose! You really are a robot! Mark was right the whole time! I can explain everything. You lied to me, Frank! How could you? I wanted to tell you for a long, long time. I was just waiting for the right moment. Waiting for the right moment? Seriously, Frank? I didn't want you to think of me different. Differently. Well, lying about it doesn't help. You know what? I need to go. Rose, wait. Don't come back. No, I don't know you anymore. <laughs> what the heck? Frank? What's wrong? Why do you care, Mark? Well, you're kind of just sitting outside crying. Yeah, good observation. I've done some thinking, and after what happened, you're right. You are a good guy. I mean, you saved my life, and it doesn't really matter if you're a robot or not. Well, thank you, Mark. I think part of it was really me being sad that my mom was moving on from my dad. I just always pictured us always together as a family, no matter what. And then when he passed away, I was starting to get used to it just being me and my mom. And then you came in the picture. But I really just want my mom to be happy, and she seems really happy with you. Yeah, she was really happy with me. Your mom found out, and she's gone. What? She's gone? Yes, just like everybody else. My whole life, I've had the brain and the heart of a person. My name is Frank, but no one no one's ever accepted me because I'm part robot. Finally felt at home. Now she's, she's gone. I'm really sorry, Frank. I'll go talk to her. I promise I'll make her change her mind. I appreciate that, Mark. Thank you. Oh, Jack, I miss you so much. I don't know what to do anymore. Hey, mom, I figured I'd find you here. I'm so sorry that I didn't believe you about Frank. I just, I just wanted to move on and be happy because I know that's what your dad would have wanted. Dad would have wanted you to be happy no matter what. And so do I. I don't care that Frank's a robot and neither should you. He doesn't seem that bad. I mean, he literally saved my life earlier. What? What are you talking about? I wasn't paying attention where I was walking and he saved me from a moving car. He's not evil. He's not scary. He's a good guy and he still loves us both. Honey, I don't care if Frank's a robot. You don't? Well, he said you were upset and left. Of course. I mean, I still love him, but I don't know if I can trust him anymore, especially after he lied to me. He was just scared. That's all. I'm scared now. I don't know what I'm going to do. And now my mom's upset with him and she's not even talking to him anymore. Oh, dude, I'm so sorry about all that. Sounds horrible. You know, Frank really isn't that bad. He's really kind and he's putting an effort to get to know me. I think I was wrong about him. Well, yeah, dude, he seems super cool. And also, man, your stepdad's a robot. Come on, please. I just need a new battery. No, 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 I'm not selling batteries to no robotic freaks. So get lost. Please, sir, just understand. I can't keep going on without a new no, no, battery. No, 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 I understand plenty. You're trying to feed off my business just like the other robot friends. No way, get out of here. Why are you the worst person ever? Not my problem. I'm gonna call the cops. Oh, this is not good. Entering low power. Frank? Low. Frank, what's going on? Are you all right? Uh, Mark, 
I'm, uh, I'm in trouble. In trouble? My systems are shutting down. I'm in low power mode. My battery is dying. Oh man, I don't think that sounds too good. Oh, no, it doesn't. I need room. Well, Frank, don't worry. I I'll fix all of this, okay? And I'll have Dylan help, right? Oh yeah, we can definitely power him up. We'll figure something out, Frank. Don't worry. Oh no, this is terrible. I know, Mom. We've got to do something about this. I can't lose another person that I care about. <sighs> this whole thing's a mess. I'm going to save Frank, Mom. Just relax. I... I just figured you needed to know what was going on. Uh, I just wish I'd never gotten a fight with him. I know everything's been complicated, but I promise you, I'm gonna save Frank, okay? And then you guys can make up and everything will be fine. I hope so. And I really want to be with Frank again. I just, I wish I could see him. Don't worry, Mom. You'll be with Frank again, I promise. I just don't think he wants you to see him like this. I bet he thinks it might scare you. Nothing scares me more than losing him. You won't, Mom. I will save him, I promise. We've got to figure out something, Dylan. We obviously can't go back to that battery store because the world and that guy hate robots, apparently. We also need to find a battery that's going to last forever because I don't want this to ever happen again. Don't worry. I know a thing or two about robots, obviously. Well, come on, mad scientist. Tell me what you're thinking. Well, I was looking into his schematic a bit. I'm thinking I could probably build a new battery. Really? Man, you are so smart. <laughs> Thanks, man. I know. Come on, Dylan, we don't have a whole lot of time. Dude, you can't rush perfection, okay? I'm working as fast as I can. And I think it's done. Really? Now you're sure this is gonna work? Yes, dude, 100% maybe. I don't really know. Honestly, it's kind of up in the air, but we'll find out. <sighs> Gotta love your confidence, man. All right, guess it's worth a shot. Man, this is really intense and kind of confusing okay is that it um yeah i think that's it now we just gotta hit the reset button uh oh uh oh what do you mean uh oh it didn't work did it oh man frank what the heck system reboot three two one hello oh my gosh she's alive uh i mean i knew it frank are you really okay i actually feel incredible i can move now and i'm no longer in low power mode Mark, what did you do? Well, it was mostly Dylan. He rebuilt you a whole new battery, and it's gonna last a whole lot longer than your older one. Well, thank you, boys. This, uh, this is incredible. What's wrong? You should be happy. Well, you fixed my battery, but you couldn't fix my broken heart. Oh my gosh, you're okay. Rose. Frank, I'm so sorry. I should have trusted you. And I should have told you sooner. Rose, I'm sorry. 